Oh hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my so-called style. I'm your go-to style guy, Levi. And um, it's time to talk about something really important. <sighs> Are you guys ready for this? I wanna break the silence. I'm usually really humble. I don't like to be in the spotlight, but <clears throat> recently something major happened and I feel like it's time to talk about it. So follow me over. Actually, I kinda wanna sit over there. So why don't we just go this way? <sighs> okay, so as I said, it's time to break the silence. I can now add to my resume that I have been a headless model. And I know, don't freak out, it's kind of a big deal. Not everyone gets this opportunity, but um, I was in a MedMen campaign as a headless model, and I feel like I just wanna get it out there. I just I just wanna come clean. I think I have something on my teeth. It's these goddamn flowers. Um. Okay, let me just get comfortable on the hammock. I'm gonna sit up a little higher. I don't know if you guys have heard of MedMen, but if you haven't, you should Google MedMen Cannabis. Um, I was recently approached by a close friend. She said, hey, I'm putting together a campaign and I think you'd be great as a headless model. And I thought, oh my God, who gets asked that? Not that many people, right? I'm starting to get recognized on the street. Um, primarily my hands, my forearms. So I found out that I'm on a t-shirt, okay? I'm not just on billboards throughout the city. I got a text the other day from a friend and she said, oh my gosh, I'm in one of the stores and you're on the t-shirt. And I was like, what? No one ever told me this. So today I wanted to just pop into the MedMen store and essentially buy a t-shirt that I'm on. We're gonna go to West Hollywood. We're gonna pick up the t-shirt. I'm freaking excited. I want you guys to come experience this with me. So let's get out of here. Not to look Cause I got some good news for you Unexpected surprise Now you're on the hook Guess what I booked a ticket for two I feel stressed and depressed I feel stuck in a room It's time we get a brand new start So get dressed, pack your bags Feel the holiday mood You won't believe what we're about to do Cause we're on This is crazy guys, this is really crazy. I'm glad you get to experience what it's like to see my billboard while I'm wearing my own t-shirt. Um, how sick is this? Ask me some questions, I guess. What's it like being famous? So, fame, you know, I've lived in LA for years and I just, I never thought it would come this way, you know, like, I had this campaign. It just sort of crept up on me, it just happened. Needless to say, I feel pretty honored. If you didn't notice the, the, the exclamation point, now you do, right? Do you find that your forearms or the sole of your shoe is highly recognizable? Do you find that, um, that is that changed your life? It's not way? so much the sole of my shoe as it is the essence of my soul. Because I think the sole of my foot sort of it just feels it feels like something else is coming out of that shoe. You know, you can feel my energy, my spirit, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Uh, generally in public, is there a way that you hide your arms to uh, to avoid being recognized? Is there something that you do uh, to to keep your forearms out of the public uh, oh, eye? Oh, okay. Yeah, my arms. Um, that's been a tough thing. I've been trying to decide if I should invest in like elbow gloves because there's been some nights where strangers walking by, you know, it's like, yo, you're the Mad Men guy, right? It's like, ah, oh, fuck. It's me, you know, it's it's embarrassing. It's I'm a shy person sometimes and I don't like being recognized on the street. You know, it's like I guess sometimes I gotta put on my shades just to to just like avoid having conversation. Hey, is that the MedMen guy? Oh. Hey. Yeah, it's me. Have you had the chance to meet uh, other people in the industry who are succeeding, right. um, who are really killing the game? So since I've just kind of broken into the industry so quickly, 
I've had the opportunity to go to some industry events with people like myself who are body parts models. It's just such an honor to be with these people and I can't tell you how many cool people I've met. I was in a cocktail lounge with the person who was holding a Cheerios box, you guys. Like, it was, I got really starstruck. I was like, I totally recognize those fingers. That index finger, I've seen that index finger somewhere. Don't tell anyone, I, I actually met Siri. Yeah, that happened. What is next for the headless Medmen model? What's next after this great experience? Um, you know, I don't want to get my hopes up, but I do feel like the next big step could be a recognizable billboard. Yeah, something with my head in it. Headless modeling is a great start to a career in Hollywood. You gotta start somewhere and I think I'm gonna put all my energy out there and hope that people want to book me for my head. <laughs> I think I have a cool head, right? Do you like this? Do you like what you're seeing? Where my head will go, no one knows. I want the world to know I'm the MedMen guy on the Rainbow Crosswalk, okay? It's me. Thanks so much for coming on this journey with me and um, get ready to see more of my body, more of these forearms, more of these hands. If you guys have any questions about what it's like to be a headless model, leave me a comment and a question in the comment. Blah. Leave me questions and comments below if you have any questions about what it's like to be a headless model. I feel like I have some pretty good advice some pretty good career advice for you guys. If you want to tune in, keep up with my channel, my so-called style, and I've got lots more things coming your way. Bye. <laughs>